Okay, here's how I see it. You and your grandparents are at a huge crossroads, a precipice, if you will. They are the bridges of Madison County, and you are Merrill Street. As the paper pages go flying off the calendar. Hey, listen to me. I'm serious here. I know you and your grandparents are playing the who can freeze out who the longest, which I know can be fun. But if you ever hope to have a relationship with them again, then someone needs to make the first move. I remember the first Christmas after we left Hartford, we were at the Independence Inn, and I got an invitation to their annual Christmas party, and I didn't go. And that one move defined our entire future relationship. I mean, if I had gone, it would have been awful, but it would have broken the ice, and maybe, and I know this is a big maybe, but maybe we would have been a tad closer than we are now or could ever hope to be. Maybe, maybe not. I just know how much you love your grandparents and how important to you it was to have a relationship with them. And I don't want the fact that you inherited my stubbornness to screw all that up. Okay, I hear you. Do you? Because my scarf is screaming as loud as it can. I will think about it. All right. We have till 6.45 Friday night, and then we're having dinner with them. What? I made the plans last night. But... Come on, Rory, Friday night dinners, cocktails, Mozart, mind games, good times. Yeah, but I'm not so sure about this. I mean... Rory, Mom already said she's really into this. You can't back out now. She is? Yeah. Grandma said she was into this? Well, you know, she didn't say it like that. She said, Oh, dinner with Rory. How delightful. There's spit spot. Alert the corgis. Mom. Yes, yes, she's into it. Now, what do you say? Okay. <gasps> okay? You want to wear my scarf to dinner? I know you do.